popping what's popping what's popping fellas today's topic is going to be women always want you when you don't care when you no longer care anymore when you stop giving it any attention and any energy bro and let me tell you something for the guys who don't already know how this goes the number one thing that women operate on is attention bro it might be your non-sexual attention it might be the attention from social media it might be the attention from the people around her if she might want the validation and attention from her family and if she likes a guy if a guy is gonna be the guy that she chooses and she wants to be around and that that's her select male bro then she's gonna want his attention his validation bro she's gonna want those things from him now here's the thing you get the worst side of women bro i'm talking about the nagging i'm talking about the the leaving you i'm talking about the rejection i'm talking about the just treating you subhuman because let's side note before we get back to you not caring and that being more attractive to women than you are caring side note as a man they don't really care about how you are they don't really care about your feelings bro the world will never care you're supposed to be hard you're supposed to be strong you're supposed to be the best version of yourself you're supposed to work and and, and go through pain because at the end of the day if you feel something they're gonna hey yo you gotta dust it up and you gotta keep moving life is challenge for a man life is hard for a man bro it's like chess like if you think about chess bro the king like and i think andrew tate said this the king can only move one space at a time and i like what that represent bro because as the king you move one space at a time oh you might learn you might learn how to create a good financial life that's one space you might learn how to invest that's another life you might learn how to get your fashion right that's another uh move on the board you might learn how to get your you know looks better etc that's another move on the board a woman she get a bbl and boom zip across the board the queen can zip everywhere she can move everywhere across the board i get a bbl i'm i'm automatically there i'm automatically where i need to be it's not that hard for them so you cannot think about women the same way that you think about you bro you can't and if nobody told you that then you know that now yeah you bro you can't think about women the same way. So when you giving all of this energy and when you pouring all of this time and attention and energy into her and you not pouring it into you, guess what? She's taking that for granted. It is free attention. It's free attention. And and let's think about it as people. Do we value things that are free, bro? If somebody came and handed you a free flat screen TV, would you value it as highly as if somebody made you pay a thousand dollars for that TV? Hell no. You worked hard for that $1,000, bro. And you chose to allocate that resource to this flat screen TV for you to enjoy as opposed to somebody just giving it to you. Somebody just gave it to you and something happened. It's going to be like, I, I mean, it was free. It was free. So I can't be too mad about it. That's how they feel about you giving them free attention, bro. When you give your attention away for free. When you just all over her and you make your whole life about her and you make your whole identity about her and she over, eh, I think I'm attracted to him. Eh, you know what I mean? I, I want to call him when I want something to eat. Eh, you know what I mean? Eh, I, I need a bunch of stuff done. So and I know this dude is going to give me all of his attention and I know this dude really, really cares about me. And I know this dude is like head over heels for me. So I'm going to use him to do all of these innocuous tasks. Hey, come over here with your wrench, bro. Come over here with your wrench so you can fix this um thing that needed to be fixed two months ago that the dude who's actually railing me out won't fix. But I could get you to fix. No, when you detach as a man. When you release this need to be Captain Save a Ho, bro, when you release this need to be her hero and you start to focus on you, women are more attracted to men on a dark triad. And the thing and the traits that they more attracted to is selfishness, bro. A little bit of self-centeredness. That don't mean take it overboard. You know what I mean? She she attract the mysteriousness of these guys. 
the state the confidence and the steadfastness that means doing what you say you're gonna do bro being congruent with who you are they're attracted to all of these traits so when you detach caring that stuff come naturally to a man because guess what we men when we when we focused on something else that's not her bro when we focused on something else we locked in guess what why do you think that and guys who have attracted women y'all know this right why do you think that when a woman flirting with you or when she like you you look over at her she look away but then you looking at something else and in the background she over there staring at you licking her lips and all of that while you looking away bro because she doesn't want direct bro they don't even communicate directly they communicate with weird intricate emotions and the sky is blue so i feel like uranus is in mars it's aura and so that makes me feel like i love you today that's how they fucking communicate bro so you really got to think about it when you detach karen when you don't care anymore, when a woman has left you, broke up with you, or decided she didn't want you or something like that, bro. When you don't care anymore is the very moment when she come back. It's like energetically they can feel it, bro. They can feel that you don't care anymore. They can feel that you moved on. They can feel that you did. And then they be acting crazy. They be acting crazy, obsessive. That's when they want to hit you up. But guess what? The energy that you giving them in that moment is meh and that's what they attracted to they want a man who doesn't put them at the center of the universe they want a man who isn't putting them on the pedestal they want a man who isn't chasing them because they want to chase you and when you remove caring about them when you can see things clearly when you're not on the inside of it and you can see man you're just trying to fucking manipulate me i'm not gonna get involved in that are you just complaining about nothing? You trying to complain just to get me to feel away so I would do this thing for you? I'm not doing that. That go against my moral code. I'm good. When you remove your feelings from it and you look at things logically as a man should. Should I be spending time with this woman over working on this project that I know I need to get done? Probably not. So now she got to wait. Hey, baby, you got to wait, man. You got to wait to get my time. I'm, I'm too busy. I'm too busy making life happen. Guess what happens? Now she values your time more because it ain't free. It ain't free no more. You don't care anymore, bro. And it ain't free no more for her. So now she know, oh, I actually have to work for his time. I got to get down and give him the Glock Glock 9000. The Hawk 2 or 3. I got to give him that if I even want him to around. I have to provide value to him if I even want him close to me. Because it ain't free no more, baby. It ain't. But you would never get to that space if you putting all this time, energy, emotion, and all of that into her. Instead of putting all this time, energy, emotion, and all of that into you. You have to remove your need for a certain outcome, bro. Y'all get so outcome dependent. I need her to end up my girlfriend and my wife for a lifetime. No man ever thought like that, bro, in the history, bro. King James the third, fourth, fifth, eighth, nigga. They had multiple women. So you think they got caught up on one woman? No. You think they was, you know, changing their whole lives? They had nations to run, bro. You think they was changing that because a woman? Decided, oh, I don't want to be with you today. I'm hormonal today. It's not working for me. No, nigga. I have more important things to do. You think the important, rich, strong, successful men, you think we care about, and I ain't rich yet, but I'm getting there. Y'all think, you think we care about a woman who, who having a moment, an emotional moment that's going to be fleeting. No, we don't. We don't have time for that. We're doing more important things, things that change the world, bro. You think Elon Musk is worried about a woman right now when he's trying to change the way that we navigate the world, essentially. No, bro. So why do you, instead of working on you, instead of giving value back to the world and essentially giving value back to everybody who touch you so that at the end of the day, she realized that you do give this value. You can't care about her that deeply, bro. She can't be more important to you than anything else. 
Hit that like button, comment, subscribe. That's the quickest way to get a woman back or anything or to get her to act right. Don't care, bro. Share the video. It's the most important thing you could do, bro. It's your boy, Ken Rick. I'm out of here.